I was lord of this place before the crows and rats made it their domain. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to some more Let's Play Modded Darkness Dungeon. All right. There's been no modding. The last part just got done compressing. I'm actually going to try to work on a backlog so I can upload these more than once every four days. I think it's time for me to try to get back into the main swing of things. Right, but that means no modding's been done, and I got some time before bed. I figured, why not? Let's record another one, uh, one of these and get it compressing overnight. Last episode, we defeated the... What was it? We defeated the uh, Necromancer. Level 5 Necromancer. And that leaves two more at this level, and that's half the original bosses then defeated. This week, we're going to be going after... The Siren, I think. And we've got... Oh, no, I'm sorry. No, we're not. No, we're not. We're going after some... A lump trinket, the dead bull, is this week. All right, and we've got the group ready to do it. So let's take care of other things first. We did successfully complete a mission, and we left there stressed out and with lots of negative quirks. So I think we'll lock Necro... I'm sorry, we'll get rid of Necromania on Magnus. Then ever did not lock any... Uh, did not get a negative quirk. Will, you gained and you've had Torn Rotator for a while. Why don't we finally treat that? And we won't lock any of these. And who else was left? That would be Sunny Sonic, who gained resolution. She won't drink but suffers extra stress damage. I don't want that on her. So we'll purge it. And we won't lock anything else. That leaves Denver, who could use some stress recovery. Been a while since we had to do this. And while we're waiting, we might as well make the treatment options a little cheaper here. The front line of this war is not in the dungeon, but rather inside the mind. For diseases. And do we have enough stuff to take an upgrade of some sort? We could take the extra Blight and Debuff skill, but I really wouldn't mind having the Altar of Light instead for 64 deeds. So no, we won't spend any more heirlooms. Do we have any Lump Trickets for sale? We do not. And I've already taken one of the Crystal People out. But it's going to be a few more weeks. I need uh, I need the sanitarium freed up so I can get rid of a few quirks on her. And then we might be good to go. Finally, for an, a never-ending... Or a... What is it? Um, oh, crap, I forget what it's called. But one of the never-ending quests. We'll see how well we do in it. It's been a while, since actually, since I've been over there in the um, the farmstead. Okay, well, I'm babbling. We're, we're set to go. So, oh, actually, we do have a Swan Disciple this week. We could pick him up and drop Lucille's. So I think we will do that. Although, uh, Eagle Eye and Quick Draw are really nice. They're really nice on a Houndsmaster. I don't have anyone else I want to drop, though. Not really. Yeah, I don't, so no. Sorry, Dudley. Maybe later, maybe if we lose somebody, I'll get a chance to re replace you with uh, that spot with another Swan Disciple. Or a Swan Disciple. Alright, is that all I need to do? No one else needs leveling, I think. Yeah, it was a group of level 5s that went out last time. Alright, then we're set. Let's, uh... Let's do this. To the cove. Okay, so... We'll take a full stack of law of them since we're bringing some already. We don't really need the anti-venom. Just one's plenty. And we don't really need the holy water where we're going either. We Just one is plenty. Full stack of torches. We'll bring enough food that we can... Why not? We'll bring... Oh! We shouldn't need that much food because we'll likely find fish in this location. We do want a full stack of medicinal herbs. We'll take a single shovel with us. Oh, actually, no, Tim, you do want uh, a few more anti-venoms and probably bandages. Because you might have a nighttime ambush 
involving the Shield Breaker. We haven't had any of her rank 3s yet. We'll also bring two keys, and I think that will do. Do we have four camping skills on it, all of us? Yes, we do. We can also prevent the nighttime ambush with Zealous Vigil, if I'm feeling up to it. Okay, well, I think we're set. What are we doing here? Um, blinding gas. I can come off of you, and will we take Noxious Blast? Okay, I think we're set to go. Oh, trinkets. We are using some very low-level trinkets on our people. Why don't we drop the Swordsman's Crest and give you the heavy boost? That's probably a little too good. It probably should be 20% move resistance, not 40%. give you the brawler's gloves. You won't crit, though, and your speed is already hideous, a draken. Oh, we could do this instead. Let's try something a little different. We will equip the ethereal crucifix, but we'll also give him the life crystal. So he's gaining... 25% damage versus Eldritch, 20% bleed resistance at the cost of one speed. So we'll try this for him. And I think we're good to go. Let's embark. I think. We're good to go, Tim. We can't heal stress this time around, so don't take Inspire Courage. Take stand your ground. Okay, let's go. Did you remember torches, Tim? That would suck if you forgot torches. I always, I'm always so worried I forget something. If we forgot torches, this will make this really interesting. I think I picked up a full stack of torches, though. We did. The smell okay. of rotting fish is almost unbearable. Normally, we wouldn't need the bandages and the anti-venom, because we are bringing Dr. Granola with us. But, just in case, we'll bring them with us this week. For the uh, camp, in case we get one of her nighttime, um, whatchamacallits. Just gonna hover over all the things really quick, so you guys see what everyone's using. Oh, God, that's a lot of backtracking. Wow. That's a ton of backtracking, and it's rooms. All right, we we need to go, kind of go to the left to start. Sorry, the right to start. So before we do that, let's search south and see if there's a curio here. And there is not. All right, well then, go off to the right to start. of all rooms. I think I can afford to skip two. We'll finish up this hallway. We'll save the treasure for our return trip where it will be darker. Oh god! Courtyard creatures! Okay. Let's pierce. We might be able to kill a seek event somewhat quickly. Oh, wow. This is going to be really bad. We still might kill it. We'll try for the zealous accusation. Got one, but not Give the other. No quarter. Assault cannot be left unanswered. 
At least we didn't get bloodied. Diseased. There either, thank god. Oh wow, he and we resisted it. We can kill the back one with a disorienting blast. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Let's medic you to the back to heal you next round. Smack him for huge damage. I didn't want this guy to live another round. Oh, that sucks. Still not diseased. Getting very beat up, though. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. I need to heal. I need to heal. Just one round, and now we'll have to kill it. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. A little too dangerous to risk more rounds just healing there. Oh, another room battle. We'll use a torch before this fight. And a food check already. We we'll use a torch before this fight, and then we will um, camp probably in that room to get our light level back up. I think we'll search this now where our light level is a little lower as well. It's acceptable. That's a huge amount of damage. Let's move up with the Serpent Sway. To get the blocks on her. We need to kill one of them, Tim. Let's try a Noxious Blast. I don't... That's a Disorienting Blast on the back one. Try to get the debuff on it. We'll shoot it. It's dead in two rounds. Of skill and purpose. We will guard our healer. Oop, that will pull him forward. Alright, good. Thank God, Fizzle Bang. We resisted that. Let's try killing one of the front ones, rather than just keep blocking. How quickly the tide turns. Good god, all the damage. Holy crap, they're not missing either. This sucks. Let's send you to the back. Oh, wrong ability. You send him to the for you send him forward instead, Tim. Um, damage you? You're dead when you activate. Slowly, gently. This is how a life is taken. Holy crap, that's a fantastic stun. And this one's dead. Let's pull you forward. Wow! Good crit heal, thank you. We needed that badly. We need to rest right after this fight, which I was, which I was planning to do anyway. We might as well heal someone. The 
Oh, I completely didn't burn a torch either, did I? I forgot to... Oh, did I burn one? No, I don't think I did. Um, I need to do a full camp. Oh, we need to get that... I want that secret room really badly. So then we don't need any of this treasure. Let's grab the Bloody Herb. Oh, we can definitely take those as well. Alright, let's camp here to get our life back up and our light restored. A spark without kindling is a goal without hope. Okay, and we need to heal. Do we have anything that can heal all of us? I don't think we do. I don't all I also don't really want to risk a nighttime ambush. So we're gonna use Zealous Vigil to stop it, I think. Unless you can stop it. You cannot. So we'll Zealous Vigil. We'll definitely use Last Stand for that stress resistance buff. The prot's also very nice, especially because our group's taking lots of damage. Let's heal with Wound Care. And then... Damage and speed. Yeah, we'll use Frontline Commander. And we rest. Wow, this is not... I'm not used to getting so beat up. Um, fighting in the dark is a really bad idea. With this group, we don't have a pure healer with us. In Radiance, may we find victory. We have a shovel, but we'll just hold on to it. We have several shovels, actually. Hello. I think, yes, Fizzlebang is fantastic at this. We'll do this fight at this light level. We might end up camping again really early. No, let's let's use let's use our torches. We we're gonna camp to have to recover our life, I think, instead. Let's try pulling the deacon forward. We will stand your ground to give everyone... Well, I, oh, the prot could be useful against this guy, but this... He's just gonna be ignoring our prot. Let's kill him. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Shuffle him forward. And kill him as well. Heal the bleed, so that we don't have to worry about taking eight damage. And then just begin working on killing the crusher. We don't have any way to chew through armor very Oh we do have, we do have pierce. That has armor piercing. She has to hit with it, though. Uh, we could send you to the back to heal you attack, but I don't think we will. Let's just sh shoot. The ground quakes. Dr. Ganola. Amazing. Monster's size has no intrinsic merit, unless inordinate exsanguination be considered a virtue. We don't have to do this room, 
and I think I'm going to avoid doing it. Let's open this up. We won't need- we won't really need the keys any, any longer. We got the- oh, yeah, I some, stuck some food in here. We, um... We just got the best treasure we can get in a dungeon run. So we'll take this over the key. I really would like to bring back the bloody to Ur, but the money's much more important. It's more important than probably the crests as well. The odds of you getting two more sapphires is also very low, Tim. We could also drop the anti-venom, but if we... I might want the cure with the courtyard creatures showing up here. We'll just do this. Oh, I, for, I completely forgot about museum coins. Darn it. Okay, let's turn around and go back. Completely forgot about the museum coins. I guess it's I guess that kind of works out for us. We're doing this for a lum trinket anyway, so. Uh, we don't even need the treasure chest anymore. We don't have any space for it. And with these puzzling trapezians, we're leaving with a ton of money. What is that? That's, uh, nine, ten thousand, five hundred just for that? Oh, crap, Tim. You're running out of food already. You've had three food checks. And you've camped for a full food rest as well. My god. We're gonna need a lot more food to get through this. Or we simply won't be able to camp again. Okay, let's start trying to kill a wide mouth to reduce the damage we'll take. took there, and we'll use a long enough to cure that that horror. Oh, no, he'll still be able to use Rolling Depths, Tim. Festering fear consumes the mind. This expedition at least promises success. We can't use Laudanum again because the buff is still in effect, unfortunately. I really do want the crests. I guess you could just drop the bloody herb, Tim. You just want it to have it in your inventory so you can take a look at it later, but... We'll drop it. Trinkets and baubles, paid for in blood. We have two holy water, which will make this really useful. Let's, um... Let's try to kill the maggot. Our appearance you should make that a piece of cake. We will stand your ground to get that buff on us. Oh, I like the color that happens when you use that skill. Very nice. Damage both of them in the front. Wow! And kill one of them as well. Awesome work. Let's send you to the back. Oh, which can't work because of standard ground. That's right. We 
will dot the bulwark. I think we can pull this guy forward, right? How's this work? Bypasses guard, breaks guard, can't be guarded. Destroyed. Oh my god! Oh, let's see if he uses Desperate Status. Will he use it? Yes, he will. Excellent, and it's working. 30% crit. Yep, but, and he loses 25% prot. Every time he uses Desperate Sedis, he'll gain this buff of damage and crit and accuracy, I think, but he'll lose the prot he's gaining every round. So we need to kill him quick. He's dead when he activates. We have a holy water with us. We have only one negative quirk. We might as well purge it while we're here. Also heal that bleed I forgot you had. And we will go to this treasure room. We can leave one more room unexplored, I think. Wow, four food checks. We may not have brought the food we needed with us this adventure. Wow, four food checks. Unbelievable. Okay, work on their stress dealer first. Should have pulled her forward, Tim, not done that. Stun their gladiator for a round, and we'll... Try to kill her with the dots? Next round, she dies. Gnawing uncertainty. The birthplace of dread. Oh, good for him guarding the, the uh, DPS they've got. She's dead when she activates. We can pull him forward with a puncture. We'll do that. Try to kill both of their fr these front two. Devastating blow. The slow death. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. Can cure the horror effect. He's still prodded. Let's stun him for a round. Try to kill the gladiator before he gets a chance to go. It's not doesn't have any of its prot on it. It's the bonus prot. It still has 50% protection. None of us are damaged. We'll keep working him. Oh my god! 16 damage! That's right. It's 8 each. It's 7 normally. And then plus 1 more point. Ghoulish horrors. Brought low and driven into the mud. I think I have fragrant wine already back at back at the camp. Uh, we'll hold on to the last laudanum, and we're not going to take any of this. We don't need what's inside this either at this rate. Let's just move on. Another food check, and we'll have extra space. Good thing it, someone's. Um, I think we're using. Yeah, we're using the ancestor's bottle. For my, it's 100% food consumed. Normally, I think this... I think the bottle normally is plus 30% max hit points, 10% stress, and plus 100% food consumed. That didn't seem like a very special item to me, so I changed the food to be minus 100 instead. Oh, 
Oh no! Okay, three sickle fans as well, Tim. This one might die if you can sell us accusation it. Clear corpse as well, make it easier to bring these two forward. Grievous injury. Palpable fear. A dragon, my god. I'm, I'm surprised you're not diseased yet. Good, got one of them. I have to kill it, even though the dragon's hurt. Alright, not as important now that it got a chance to go. We will. Wow, another crit heal on the dragon. Amazing. Stun it. We've got to kill it this round, but I think I can wait and try to get off a heal. Obliterated. Oh, thank God for the food. As victories mount, so too will resistance. We'll use the last of those to heal some more stress. And then I think we'll take some more deeds at the moment. Oh, good. More food. Thank God. A fortune waiting to be spent. Two rubies. We'll take those over our those crests. That's 2,500. Let's start... Ah, but I tried to drag him forward to kill him quickly. That did not work. And now we get a stress wave for our trouble. Don it. And get a debuff on him for that damage penalty. Fishhook actually stuck. That's awkward. I don't think you can do this to yourself. Let's get back up there. He'll die unless he gets healed from the shaman. Oh, focusing on you, Fizzlebang. Interesting. Oh, wow. They really are, too. They want to kill you. Should have shot the harpooner. Inspiration and improvement. We'll heal you in a little bit. I want this guy to die. Stun him. Now we don't have to worry about him next round. Death by inches. Oh, that was a mistake. Should have done that. Should have healed him instead. Let's us uh, serpent sway. And start that healing on Fizzlebang, who desperately needs it. Oh god, eight. Oh wow, nineteen. Very nice. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. Pull him forward so that he's more likely to use his stab. So bang, you'd be healed all that damage you took. A trifling victory. But a victory nonetheless. You get even more food and another ruby. Amazing. Let's drop the holy water now. And we'll take more cash. We can open this. We have an anti-venom and a bandage. So, we can risk it. I don't have
have room for either of those. First, oh, our first blockade. Actually, we, before we do that, we should just pop up here and disarm the the trap. We can't see that. Bu that bug's still in effect, huh? That bug's still in effect. Sometimes you get traps that you just can't see at all. It's a glitch, but I guess it's still. It's been around since the game was in early access, back in uh, its old beta days. I can't really hold the gems. I don't want to drop the anti-venom because I want another cure. Another mariner, another misfortune. So many battles today. I have a bad feeling about this fight. I think this might be a collector. Okay, it is not. Kill one of the maggots quickly, so we don't have to worry about their debuff and diseases. Try stunning another one. It did not work. But it will die to that all the same. And then... Uh, let's stand your ground. Get ready for that skull toss. Get a debuff on it. We'll soften him up. Um, just uh, I would say, just try to kill it because it's gonna rend us if it decides to attack. Good hit there, Fizzlebang. Thank you. So much he likes being stunned. That buys us around the heel as well. Amazing crits, Dr. Canola. Thank you. Their cursed champion falls. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. We don't need any of that at the moment. We're running out of things to explore. We probably should think about camping up ahead. We'll check this singular this singular room. Sure, we'll start lighting the crusher. Pull him forward, though. I still would like to kill him first. Would have had another 2,000 thanks to all the onyxes, but I think we'll just let this go. We, actually, we can probably drop the medicinal herbs soon. We've got enough fish that we picked up all the food that we ended up needing. Bit exciting, this one, hasn't it? Our stress has uh, been difficult to, to manage. Is struck. A blazing star is born. 
we'll finally start taking the onyxes with us. Oh, have I been discarding money? Have I been doing that? I, I hope not. We have plenty of food now to see us to the end. We could open this up. Let's uh, let's do so. I think we have the shovels to hopefully see us to the the end here. The way is lit. The path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. I think we'll drop the bandages now. Trap in this hallway. There's gotta be a trap in this hallway. Oh, nice. We'll take the torch, absolutely. Tempting. Tempting to take the busts, but we'll leave them. Oh, for, I forgot this thing has stealth. There's no reason why we shouldn't kill their backline support as soon as possible. Still can't hit it. Let's, um... Get back up there. Oh, it moves you to the back. Interesting. Oof, 8 damage. Good god! 20 damage. Nice crit there, Silu. Thank you. Tim, you're not going to have a, a heal. Oh, thank God it missed. That would have been nightmarish. I like that change I did to it. I like that a lot. I love the double stun. I love it. It's a 50% chance that it does it at this level. It's up to 65, um, 65 at champion level. dead in two rounds. You're dead next round. Okay. Don't want to kill the stinger. I need it to survive. Because I need to heal that that bleed. The blood quickens. Nice, Dr. Granola. You're critting an amazingly high amount. I love that. I really do like that a lot, that change. Victory. Perhaps the turning point. Success so clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? Nothing I'm willing to drop for that yet. Hello, trap. Fizzle Bang has a 100% chance to disarm you, and we'll do that. Another torch! We're getting really lucky with the torches. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Okay. Let's begin by dotting the crusher. We'll kill the shaman first. Need to 
make sure that still works. Let's send you to the back to get healed. Oh, wow. Crit on it. I forgot it had repost on it. I just checked it. The abyss returns even the boldest gaze. If that sticks, we may be losing you, Siloom. We need to spread that damage out because you go so quickly. Oh, Tim, his repost is up. Teetering on the brink. I, I keep forgetting that it's got repost. And now you're going to get a lot of stress for Draken. We might have to camp after this. Send you to the back again to heal some of that damage. Cure that bleed. Good, where Draken can take the hit instead this turn. The bigger the beast, the we need to kill this thing so we don't get any more horror effects on us. But I also, I must heal some of that damage Silum's taking. Masterfully executed. Sending you back so you can keep getting healed. Stun it one round so we can heal one more round. We, we will kill it this turn, though. Precipitates a dizzying fall. We'll camp here to get our light level back and clear out an inventory space. Huddled together, furtive and vulnerable. Rats in a maze. And we will take the jute tapestry for even more money. We shouldn't need this much food, either, so we can drop three food for some D, uh, crests. Okay, so we, let's prevent the nighttime ambush again. I think we'll also use Zealous Speech to get some more stress down. We'll use Encourage. Twice. 24 stress, 15 stress. We got very lucky. We we survived a few battles where we should. Well, not that we should. Maybe we did take a, quite a bit of damage, but those crits from Dr. Granola were very As lucky. We've been getting purchase, very lucky. Spirits are lifted, and purpose is made clear. In how much, um. How many crits we've received? Ten, for the most part. And thank God, almost all of a dragon getting the big heals. I'm surprised we weren't stressed out either. We've been doing well there too, I suppose. Thankfully, just enough. We also got lucky with all the food we picked up. We wouldn't have been able to have a normal uh, big feast right there. Okay, it's over. Uh, I guess we skipped one room. We'll go up north this way. We can get this trap on the way. Thank you, Fizzlebang. Two blood and a hundred bucks. I think we'll take the blood. And we'll drop the medicinal herbs for it. It's been a while since we've taken blood back with us. We might as well keep going. We'll at least search what this curio is. Since we have stuff we can throw away now. 
fun adventure. Very fun. Was a little nervous for a bit. Almost lost you, Silent, thanks to me not remembering that feeding frenzy gives that creature post. And it's just a box. Heirloom's in it, though. And some boots. All right, so we don't need you. We're not proceeding onward. And we're done. We will find all manner of great and terrible things in this watery tomb. $31,000. Eight deeds and 16 crests also. Very nice. Looks like Silent picked up a disease. Getting the Red Plague. Dr. Gondola also gained a disease. Vampiric Spirits, Armor Smith, and Deviant Tastes. Fizzlebang has gained Scattering. We don't want that. I think this is the second time you've gotten this, Fizzlebang. We'll make sure that we take that off of you as well. But all that can happen next week. Ah! Sulfur in the air. The wolves are at the door. Brigand Incursion. Two arms. A brigand raiding party is descending upon the hamlet with explosive fury and murderous intent. Plot quest. Wolves at the door. This quest will be... Uh, let's read this first and then we'll talk about it. Haltbrook has left in search of a holy vision. Then ever Halterbrook prayed and recovered 69 stress. Sunny Sonic removed resolution. Clove Numenor removed tone rotator. Magus removed necromania. We have wolves at the door. We have Dr. Gondola who's level 5. Thizzlebang level 4. And Silum is level 4. So we have the Hamlet under attack. We have to kill one brigand Volf. Now, we don't have to kill him. We can send a group of level 1s here, for example. And someone will die upon the retreat. And it stops the... Or maybe we just have to stick the whole thing out. But I think we can flee. And as long as we showed up... We stop the negative from happening if this event goes through. If we send no one here, if we ignore this event, then I believe our town gets damaged. We lose some of the upgrades we have invested in our town. We've invested quite a lot, so we should try to stop it. It's filled with brigands, and it's not going to be an easy fight. Especially since uh, Denever is not present this round. And we have people who have a lot of stress on us as well. But I think we might be able to do it. I think if we bring Yogg Sasoth, Valkyrie Malice, Evil Mega Cookie, and maybe Alistar, that might give us what we need to win. Or Yumi Yumi. It's going to be real instead of uh, Alistar. It's going to be really tricky, though. Really, really tricky. Because if we go. Well, worst case scenario, we go after Wolf. We can't beat him. We flee the fight. Someone has to sacrifice their life for the rest of the people to survive. If we do kill Wolf, we'll never get this encounter ever again. And we would also earn Wolf's Tassel as a trophy. Anyway, that's um, that's what we have. So thank you all for watching. We'll have to see if, what I'm going to do about that next week. We still have no Lum Trinkets. Thank you all for watching. And I will see you all in the next one. Where we'll probably be going after Wolf. In any case, I'll see you guys then. Take care, everyone.